Good morning, my friends. This is Miss Ray from the Great Falls Public Library, and it is time for story time. It's a whole new month. Now it's May, and in May, we are celebrating math magic. So we will be doing a lot of songs and stories to work on our counting, to work on math concepts like addition and subtraction, and we're going to have a lot of fun, but I do have a special announcement. So on May 18th, which is a Wednesday, two weeks from now, the Voyagers will be joining us. They are going to join us for our in-person story time that morning at 1030 in the library basement. We'll do a uh, baseball themed story time. It will be so much fun, but drum roll. They are going to join, uh, join us for our story time here live on Facebook too. Isn't that so cool? We've never had a special guest on our, um, our uh, story time live here on Facebook. So this is going to be so much fun. I really, really hope you can join us. You can either um, watch live or you can watch the recording later. Um, whatever works for you and your family, but I hope that you will join us because it is going to be wonderful. All right, so we are going to start this off with a counting chant. All right, here we go. Everybody count one. One. Story time has just begun. Good job. Everybody count two. Two. Shake your shoulders. Show your shoes. Everybody count three. Three. Listen very carefully. Everybody count four. Four. Put your bottoms on the floor. Good job. Let's do it again. Everybody count one. One. Story time has just begun. Everybody count two. Two. Shake your shoulders. Show your shoes. Everybody count three. Three. Listen very carefully. Everybody count four. Four. Put your bottoms on the floor. Nice job. All right. Let's do a counting rhyme. This is five elephants in the bathtub. We are going to start with one. There's one elephant in the bathtub. Now, very important question, guys. If you have a bathtub at your house, how many elephants do you think would fit in there? Think about it. I don't know. I'm not sure that five whole elephants would fit in my bathtub. I don't think that five elephants would fit. What would happen if you had too many elephants in your bathtub? What would happen? Do you think the water would get on the floor? I think the tub might overflow if we have too many elephants in there. Let's see what happens. All right, so we're gonna start with one elephant in the bathtub going for a swim. And then there's going to be a knock, knock on the door. Maybe there's a table you can knock on. Maybe you can clap your hands. Knock, knock. Knock, knock. Good job. Splash. Oh, splash, splash. Here we go. We're going to pat our thighs for that. Splash, splash. That's the elephant getting out of the bathtub. Don't let the next elephant in. And come on in. Let's try it all together. We're gonna to start with one elephant in the bathtub. Here we go. One elephant in the bathtub going for a swim. Knock, knock, splash, splash. Come on in. Good job. So we had one elephant and then we add one more elephant. How many elephants do we have now? Two elephants in the bathtub. How many more elephants will fit in the bathtub? I don't know. Here we go. Two elephants in the bathtub going for a swim. Knock, knock, splash, splash. Come on in. Good job. So we had two elephants in the bathtub and then one more got in. How many elephants are in the bathtub now? One, two, three. Here we go. Three elephants in the bathtub going for a swim. Knock, knock, splash, splash. Come on in. Good job. So we had three elephants. Now we have one more. How many elephants are there in that bathtub? Four, good job. You guys are really good at counting. Here we go. Four elephants in the bathtub going for a swim. Knock, knock, splash, splash, come on in. We had four elephants. 
We added one more. How many elephants is that now? Five elephants in the bathtub. That's a lot of elephants in the bathtub. All right. Let's add, try to add one more and let's see if it fits. Here we go. Five elephants in the bathtub going for a swim. Knock, knock, splash, splash. They all fell in. And that is the end. Five elephants fit. I don't think we can fit any more than five elephants in that bathtub. And I think there is going to be a lot of water on the floor. We are going to need a lot of towels. All right, let's read our story. This is One Drowsy Dragon. It was written and illustrated by Ethan Long. This, this little, little blue dragon here is having a problem. The problem is, did I say elephant? This little dragon, this little blue dragon has a problem. That little blue dragon would like to sleep, but all of the other dragons are wide awake. Let's read what happens. One marching dragon clanging on a cup. Ooh, I forgot this part, guys. I need you to help me make these noises. So do you see this dragon is banging on a metal cup with a spoon and making a clang, clang, clang noise. Will you help me make that noise? Clang, 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 clang. Oh, noisy. So noisy. One marching dragon clanging on a cup. One drowsy dragon mumbles, don't wake me up. Two noisy dragons battle, zonk, whirl, bleep. Let's try those sounds with the, that, they're, that their laser toys are making. Zonk, zonk, whirl, 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 bleep, bleep, bleep. One weary dragon moans, please let me sleep. Three dancing dragons learn to tap, tap, tap. Tap dancing dragons, they go tap, 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 tap. Can you tap your toes? Tap, 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 tap. Yes, one groggy dragon groans. I want to nap. Four feisty dragons wrestle on the ground. This one says, I. Will you help me make that noise? I. This one says grunt, grunt, grunt. And this one says oof, oof, oof. One tired dragon asks, please keep it down. Very noisy wrestling. Five laughing dragons dump their games and toys. All right, the dominoes are making a noise that goes click, 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 clickety click. Click, 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 click. The truck goes whoosh, whoosh. Fast truck, whoosh, whoosh. One grumpy dragon hollers, too much noise, too much noise. They are not having any luck at all sleeping, are they? All the other dragons want to play. Six thirsty dragons make a berry shake. The blender goes, Whirr, whirr, whirr. One mad dragon yells, I am still awake. I am still awake. Oh, getting very grouchy now. Seven screaming dragons watch a scary show. Look, the vampire dragon says, blah, 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 blah. And look, all of the other dragons are so scared. And this one says, ah! And these say, eek, 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 eek. Yikes, yikes, yikes. One loud dragon shouts, I'm tired, you know. Eight rambunctious dragons all play croquet. It's a game where you hit balls with mallets. They're kind of like 
like long wooden hammers. You hit the balls and try to get them through those loops. And they are hitting the balls and going tap, 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 tap. One angry dragon screams, put that away. So grumpy now. Nine rockin' dragons jam in a loud band. Oh my goodness, so many sounds going on here. This dragon is playing a triangle and it goes ting, 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 ting. And this dragon is playing a bass and it goes bum da bum bum. Bum diddy bum, bum diddy bum, bum diddy bum. That dragon is playing drums and the drums go rat a tat tat, rat a tat tat, rat a tat tat, rat a tat tat. This dragon is singing la la la, la la la. Oh, goodness, this dragon is playing a trumpet. And the trumpet goes toot, 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 toot. One worn dragon shrieks, this I cannot stand. <sighs> Just done. Ten talker dragons think it's time for bed. <gasps> the other dragons got tired. They played so hard they wore themselves out. Now they're ready for a nap. One weary dragon rests his sleepy head. Finally, some peace and quiet and a chance to sleep. One drowsy dragon finally snores deep. Snore. 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 Ten drowsy dragons say, shh, it's time to sleep. Now the sleepy dragon is keeping the others awake. Oh, the irony. We did not expect that, right? That's a kind of irony. This book is torn. We're missing part of this page. Oh no, oh no. So what's going to happen next? Hmm? Do you think that all the dragons will be able to sleep? Or do you think that the blue dragon will never be able to sleep and will just get grumpier and grumpier? Hmm. Could go either way. I hope you like that story. <laughs> On the back, I don't know if you can see him. Here's the vampire dragon that goes blah, blah, blah. <laughs> and all of the, the scared dragons watching the scary movie going eek, eek, eek. So you can check out this book and we have lots of other counting books. I think there's, um, we have another dragon count, counting book. It's called, Have You Seen My Dragon? And that's a really good one because I know you guys are amazing at counting. This one just counted up to, how high did we count? We counted up to 10. But, Have You Seen My Dragon? That one goes up to 20 because I know you guys are amazing counters and you need a challenge. Yeah. So, you can check that one out too. Thanks for joining us. I'll see you next Wednesday morning for another counting book. And then the week after, at 945, the Voyagers will be here with us. And we will read, well, I think we're going to read baseball books. But we'll see. I bet they have something really special in mind for us. So thanks, everybody, for watching. I will see you next week. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, friends. <laughs>